hello and uh, welcome once again in this video i want to show you how you can quickly add in skin details to your character in blender yeah so uh, firstly you want to make sure your character is selected and you have the multi resolution modifier applied to your character the second step is actually going to sculpt mode which i'm going to do now so uh, thirdly i want to make sure the resolution is high enough in order to be able to sculpt the skin details so i want currently I'm, i think i need at least 6 million polygons for this particular character so i'm going to just increase the subdivision i'll keep subdividing till i see the face count is up to 6 million right there so i think five subdivision level is actually all right for me yeah so uh in case you don't know how to bring out this uh, option here all, all you just need to do is click on this drop down in the overlay property and make sure statistics is checked so you can see the body count on your character so uh the next thing i want to do is to create a custom brush that i would use in sculpting in the skin detail so to do that i would go into the i would go into the two settings which is right here and i want to use the draw brush as my base for creating this brush so i would create the draw brush and name this stamp so i'll scroll down change the stroke type from space to anchored and i would create a new texture which i would uh, we would import my skin detail the uh, skin pose alpha from i would change the mapping from tiled to area plane and go into the texture and uh, properties and open the skin stamp that i have on my lap that i've downloaded actually so yeah i think i would go with this Yeah, so uh, I'm all set right now. So all of this will reduce the strength of my brush. Let's see, something like this. And so I'll just click and drag to add in this nice skin pose in the areas where they are needed. Something like that. Yeah, so um, basically, that's just the, that is just the simple process. So, adding alphas and sculpting with alphas in blender yeah quick note so this method isn't only applicable to character sculpting it can also be applied to hard surface sculpting and other sculpting so long as you are working with alphas <laughs>